Now Jesus loved Martha and her sister and Lazarus. So when he heard that Lazarus was ill, he stayed two days longer in the place where he was. John 11, 5 through 6. Mary and Martha were distraught that their brother was sick unto death. So they send word to Jesus asking for his help. Jesus, upon hearing the news, says to those around him that this sickness is to serve a purpose, to glorify God and the Son of God. The next verse starts out with these words. Now Jesus loved Martha and her sister and Lazarus. What you would anticipate, given that beginning to the sentence, is that it would conclude with words something like, So he immediately stopped what he was doing and went with haste to the place where they were staying. The reason it doesn't end that way is because Jesus had a different plan than Mary and Martha. Jesus had a different plan than what his disciples anticipated. After Jesus had stayed two more days in the place where he received the news, he then tells the disciples that it's time to head to Judea. The disciples aren't wild about the idea. Um, last time we were in Judea, they tried to kill you. Are you sure it's a good idea for us to go back? Again, Jesus' plan wasn't the disciples' plan. In our own lives, oftentimes, God's plan is not our plan. We think we know best. We think we know what we and our loved ones need. But sometimes God has a different idea. I shared a story where this was true on Sunday. Johnny Erickson Tata had a great life and a bright future, but a swimming accident interrupted all of that. Misjudging the depth of the water, Johnny dove in and suffered a spinal cord injury that left her a quadriplegic. It took her a long time to realize that God had a plan all along and that his plan was far better than her plan. Mary and Martha, plus the disciples, were not convinced that Jesus had put together a good plan. But soon, Lazarus would be raised from the dead, many would come to faith, and everyone who had doubted came to believe that Jesus really did know what he was doing. May God grant us faith to believe that when our plan isn't the same as his plan, his was the best by far all along. Press on in the Lord.